Hello guys, in this class I would tell you how to create the software. So um, if you're going to a menu inserting the design features, you will find the software. Let's just click at this. And default is the datum coordinate system center of that. So the specific point just in here. So I can directly give a diameters. Say I would tap 50, uh, 50 millimeters and I hit it OK. So at that moment, I can create this kind of affair, right? And um, you could also, like, um, if you're going to uh, insert design features as uh, affairs, you could directly click on the uh, in somewhere by a randomly and you could give the diameters that you want, right? For examples, um, yeah, so let, let, let's do this first. I'm going to uh, design features and surface and click randomly on the space and the diameter is 50 millimeters and I hit it apply. You could got this kind of uh, surface, right? And if you're going to click on sketch on this plan, I hit it OK. And then I this moment, I just click the point. I can click a point in here. So I can go into repeatedly prototypes to define the specific dimensions of this, right? 54 and the height of that is 63. OK, I just define this point and you could just go into a menu, insert, and design features. Let's just create it, click the surface. You could directly click on this point you just created before. And then you tap something like um, like a 20. So you could uh, generate this kind of uh, surface, right? If on the sketch, on this plan, I already have a for like tangos um, and then um, finish this and click this I'm going to a uh, home and then extruded this rectangles I hit it apply and I'm doing a sketch okay and um, in here I'm just to uh, click the point in here okay and then I'm going to a menu insert surface um, design features affairs and click this point okay and diameter is 20 um, maybe I can just change to 40 and the bottom I'm doing a subtract with this object and let's hit the play to see what's gonna happen in here so you're gonna directly doing a subtract on this cube you just created another way to just uh, doing a sapphire is if I go into a sketch and hit it apply and then the moment I do a circular sketch and then I'm going to um, line and it captures uh, open this court, uh, court point so I can capture the quarter point right and at this moment you go into a train you're just doing the quick train to cut this half of this shape and uh, you need to go into uh, extrude drop down menu, select the revolve, and then you click specify vectors of this line. And angle is 360 degrees. Keep this really good, and you need to hit it apply. So you could also got a uh, surface just created by a revolve order, right? Okay, guys, and uh, today we tutorial about how to create a sapphire, sapphire just. Uh, introduced to here so if you have any comments just leave to me and um, if you like the video just go subscribe to my channel okay bye see you next class